to our assistance. Lord, make haste to help us. Let justice flow like water. And integrity like a free stream. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. John. Jesus came to a Samaritan city called Sychar, near the plot of ground that Jacob had given to his son Joseph. Jacob's well was there, and Jesus, tired out by his journey, was sitting by the well. It was about noon. A Samaritan woman came to draw water, and Jesus said to her, Give me a drink. The Samaritan woman said to him, How is it that you, a Jew, ask a drink of me, a woman of Samaria? Jesus answered her, If you knew the gift of God, and who it is that is saying to you, Give me a drink, you would have asked him, and he would have given you living water. The women said to him, Sir, you have no bucket, and the well is deep. Where do you get that living water? Are you greater than our ancestor Jacob, who gave us the well, and with his sons and his flocks drank from it? Jesus said to her, Everyone who drinks of this water will be thirsty again. But those who drink of the water that I will give them will never be thirsty. The water that I will give will become in them a spring of water gushing up to eternal life. The woman said to him, Sir, give me this water so that I may never be thirsty or have to keep coming here to draw water. Just then his disciples came. They were astonished that he was speaking with a woman. But no one said, What do you want? Or why are you speaking with her? Then the woman left her water jar and went back to the city. Meanwhile the disciples were urging him, Rabbi, eat something. But he said to them, I have food to eat that you do not know about. My food is to do the will of him who sent me and to complete his work. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. God of the poor, you have placed us in this world to be instruments of your love and peace. Help us care for the most abandoned and for us that of this earth. Bring healing to our lives that we may protect the world and not prey on it. That we may sow beauty, not destruction. Teach us to discover the worth of small things, to be filled with awe and contemplation. To recognize our communion with your every creature as we journey towards your infinite light. Be with us even more, we pray, in our fight for truth, justice, love, and peace. Protect us with your power and might. Let us pray. O oh God, you have willed that your church be the sacrament of salvation for all nations, so that Christ's saving work may continue to the end of the ages. Stir up, we pray, the hearts of your faithful, and grant that they may feel a more urgent call to work for the salvation of every creature so that from all the peoples on earth, one family and one people of your own may arise and increase. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, 
forever and ever. Amen. Amen. I will continue, O oh my God, to do all my actions for the love of you. Live Jesus in our hearts. Forever. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God.